Hi little skeletons, it is Disney Queen Skelly here. Welcome back to another reacting video. So this one is going to be for the ultimate 90s Disney qui kid quiz. Um, you guys already know I took this quiz, so we're just going to see how Harley Baby does. But if you don't know how my reacting videos work, I watch um, a video that she's done, pause it when I have something to say, and then at the end we give her an overall rating. So let's do this. I got some headphones in today, so hopefully you'll be able to hear me a little bit better. But I'm back in again with another quiz. This is the ultimate 90s kid trivia quiz. I was born in about the mid-90s, so let's see how that got. Okay, if I caught what she said earlier, she said she put headphones on so we could hear her a bit better. Honey, I still can't hear you. <laughs> And I can't even wear my headphones. I tried wearing my headphones and I couldn't even hear who threw those. So, yeah. <laughs> but she was born in the mid-90s. She was 90, well, not, well, kind of mid. She was born in 94. Yes, 94. But, I mean, we're going to try this, guys. We're going to try. Thank you. Into the following was not the song from a 90s Disney movie. Beauty and the Beast, I'm the man of you, part of your world, so go back to she better know this one, because this movie is her movie. It's like Poor Girl was in 1989, so we're gonna go with that. Yes. Pepper Ann is too cool for... I think I lost Pepper Ann. Um... Too cool for middle school? Oh, okay. I'm pretty sure I picked the same one. Which of the following 90s Disney Channel original movies is the oldest? Looking back, I'm pretty sure it's either Brink or Xenon. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's gotta be Brink then. I'm pretty sure it's gotta be Brink. True or false, Disney.com was an accessible website in the 90s. I think so. It was, and I picked false because I didn't think it was, because I'm not smart. Okay. Who appeared on the cover of the first issue of Disney Adventure Magazine with Tailspin? Michael Jordan? The only one I can know is Michael Jordan. Okay, no. I'm pretty sure I picked Michael Jordan, too. Which duo directed 1997's Hercules? Uh... My thoughts exactly, sweetie. This... Okay. Provided the singing voice of Shane in one. That was Donny Osmond. It's the little things she knows. She keeps just proving my point every damn day. What is Jack Kelly's real name in the movies? David Jacobs? Okay. True or false? Disney Channel's Bug Juice was a reality series centered around an OCP. That's, I think, yes. Okay, this is a recess. Of TJ Dittweiler, Dittweiler? What? Did she just say Dittweiler? <laughs> As the main character in Recess, what does TJ stand for? Theodore James? Okay. Nope. It was, hang on, let me go back. It was, I think, Theodore Jasper. Who was not a member of the new Mickey Mouse book? Britney Spears? Yes. Christina Aguilera? Yes. How does she know this shit? I don't think it was Ryan Reynolds. Okay. I'm pretty sure I picked Ryan Reynolds because it didn't seem like something he would do, but I don't remember. Which of the following Disney Channel shows premiered in the 90s and not in the noughties? I'm pretty sure it was So Weird or The Proud Family. I have no idea. Maybe li You know, all of these seemed like they would be 90s TV shows and early 2000s TV shows, so I guess we'll never know. Or 2000s. Lizzie McGuire, so weird. Even Stevens are a proud family. I think Lizzie McGuire was in the 2000s. So weird. Was... You can see the gears grinding in her head. She thought about this a lot longer than I did. Okay. Who wrote the Tarzan soundtrack? That was. Oh no, that was Phil Collins. Or are you not about to pick Phil Collins? We need a fight. I mean, they can get me to the movie. Okay. Which Disney Pixar movie was not released in the 90s? You should know this, honey. You should know this. Not released in the 90s? That was Monster 
easy. Yes. Add a girl. Okay. What type of animal was Timon from the Lion King? He's a weird cat. Of the following, which movie was the first Walt Disney Animation Studios film to be released in the 90s? Looking back, I believe it is The Rescuers Down Under. Was that Beauty and the Beast? Mm. No. Okay. I made the same mistake. I'm betting dollars to donuts it is The Rescuers Down Under. Okay. Who voiced Thomas in Pocahontas? Christian Bale? Okay. I made the same guess and I was right. What is the name of Drake Mallard's alter ego? Darkwing Duck! Even I don't watch Darkwing Duck and I knew that. What is the name of the opening song? In Beauty and the Beast, that would be them. What does Genie ask Aladdin to wish for right after he sets him free? The Nile. Wish for the Nile, please. Wish for the Nile. <laughs> I got 12. Okay. I'll be honest, I'm pretty sure she actually did better than I did. Not as bad as I thought it was going to do. The 90s were a long time ago, sadly, so we understand your score. However, we know you have it in you to score even better. Try once more. I don't think so. Well, that was the 90s quiz. If you guys take this quiz, I'm curious to what your, answer, what your answers would be and how many you would get right. Where are my 90s kids out there? 1998! Thank you so much for watching, Puddins. I love you. So overall, the video was actually pretty good. Um, I actually, I kid you not, the intro you just saw took three takes. I have never done three takes of an intro, ever. And it's only because I couldn't hear her the first time. I tried my headphones, and my headphones went deaf. And then I did it a third time, figuring what the hell, I'll try to make out what she says. I literally had to pull my laptop forward because I just realized my speakers are actually underneath my laptop. Why? <laughs> so I pulled it out. I could finally hear her. So I'm going to give this video, out of frustration, a 6 out of 10. I'm sorry, Harley Baby. I love you, but I was just super frustrated trying to film this whole thing. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Again, be sure to subscribe to Harley Baby and check out the video that I just uh, watched. You can probably hear it for yourself better through headphones on your phone or something like that. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Bye little skeletons. Stay safe. I love you guys.